Hey guys, today in this video, we are gonna be talking about how you can transfer files from your Android device to your MacBook in just two simple methods. And this is Anjul Sharma for the last time saying, let's hit the intro. Okay, so the first method that I'm gonna be telling you is the wireless method, which is basically using cloud services like Google Drive, Dropbox or OneDrive. So first open Google Drive on your device and here click the plus new button in the bottom right corner of the app and now choose the upload option and here choose what you want to upload you can either choose a folder a doc a sheet or even a slide you can also choose upload to open the file browser and then pick another file so let's select the recent files that i want to share on my mac so select all of the files that you want to share now just tap on select here and now wait for the file to complete uploading so now when the upload process is complete you can go to drive.google.com in your web browser of choice on your mac and then download files by right clicking and choosing download. So after you have reached to drive.google.com, make sure that your same account is signed in into the Google Drive account. Now here you'll see all of the files you previously uploaded. So just select all of them, right click and just tap and just click on download. And you're done, the download will start in few seconds and that way all of your files will come in the Mac. And that too wirelessly. So that was pretty easy, right? So similarly, if you don't use Google Drive, then the steps are also similar for OneDrive as well. All right, that was the method for the wireless transfer. Now let's talk about the wire transfer that you have to do to get your data from your Android device to your Mac. So first you have to download Android file transfer for the Mac from the Android website. So just go to this link, which of course will be shared in the description as well. And here click on free download for Mac. So after the file has been downloaded, so open this Android file transfer.dmg file and just drag and drop Android file transfer to applications now here go to the launch pad and here you will see the application has been installed so just open it so now you have to connect your mac to your android device using its usb cable so let's do that so i'm connecting my usb cable and here allow accessory to connect so just click on allow so now on your phone just go to the usb preferences and here use usb for file transfer slash android auto so just select this and now add your password now you can easily see that all of my files on my android device are now showing into my mac so that way i can access all of the files that i want so let's just say if i open dcim camera so here all of my photos are and in the downloads there are other files as well then there's nearby share send anywhere mu movies music but mostly all of your files will be in the DCIM folder only especially the photos and videos so now to transfer all of these files directly on your mac just open the finder window here and choose any place that you want your photos to be now just drag any of the photo that you want into this finder section here and you can see that all of the other files are automatically coming on my mac this is so crazy so as you can see this is super easy you can transfer any file that you want right here on your mac this feels like magic because I'm a magician. This method is completely offline and uses local storage only. So you just need a little bit of data to download the Android file transfer.dmg file. And to download that, I've given the link in the description. So you can just check it out from there. And the download is super easy. Having said that, these were the best and the most easiest methods that you can try out to transfer your file seamlessly from your Android device to your Mac. And lastly, in this video, there's no outro. What? Because this is gonna be my last video as I won't be making any more videos on this channel. No. But having said that, if you're watching this, I just want to thank you for all of your support and the love that you've given me over the years. I read all of your comments. And most of the comments are very positive and I even enjoy the negative comments as well. Wow. So thank you to each of the people that have commented on our videos and showered their love and hate as well. But don't worry if you want to connect with me and see what I'm gonna do in future. You can either follow me on Instagram or on YouTube as well. And with that, for the last time, I won't see you guys in the next video. But still, you have to keep enjoying your life because it is your chance to enjoy your life because life comes only one time. So seize the opportunity.